What's up guys, my name is Rildab Derek and today I'm going to be explaining the change log for the server update that just came out yesterday, server update 2. So let's get to it. So the first thing is added 10 hidden chests. So basically that means there are 10 hidden chests among the world. Whether it's in the overworld, in the nether, there are 10 hidden chests. I'm not going to tell you the content inside the chest. I know one person has found one of the 10 hidden chests so far. So that's basically it for that. Extended the subway. That means I basically stretched the subway, making it a little bit longer than it already is. Add in another line of the subway. So before the update, there was mainly just one line and then half of another line. So I extended that other line of the subway to make it about the same size as the other one. Added more stops to the subway, making it easier to get out and get off or get on the subway. Added torches to the rail station, lit means in service while unlit means out of service. This basically means if a torch is lit in the rail station, that means it is in service, it's perfectly fine, there's nothing wrong with it. If it's unlit, which that means that it's out of service, meaning it's inactive, it's not being used. Blinking means that it's under construction. Added more street names, that's very obvious. Added more trees to the wilderness, that's very self-explanatory. Began work on the game center. The game center is basically this area that will be used for mini games for the server. Um, added a minecart to plot chests, that's so you can get around the server a little bit easier with the subway. Added rank names 3 and through 8. I know it's kind of crazy, but ranks 3 through 8 didn't have a name. Rank 3 is now blacksmith, rank 4 is specialist, rank 5 is warrior, rank 6 is elite, rank 7 is noble, and rank 8 is trusted player. I know you guys are probably wondering how to rank up. It's just really time, how much time you spend on the server and stuff like that. Added easy difficulty, basically I switched it from peaceful to easy. Added daily mail. Um, th this is basically something that you'll get, like food every day or so. Added more tips for beginners. I basically added some tips and tricks, kind of, for beginners. Um, added spleef and skyblock 2v2v2 as games in development in the game center. Those are two games that I'm working on in the game center that will come out in a later server update and fix some abandoned plots. Basically just rip the crap out of some plots that are kind of abandoned. No one's using them and stuff like that. So that's basically it for this change log, guys. I hope you guys now understand what is in this update. I know it's not a whole lot, but I can promise you the next few updates are going to have a ton of stuff that you guys are going to enjoy. So if you guys enjoyed the video, please be sure to like and subscribe, and I'll talk to you all later. Peace.